Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So if you are a Windows Insider, then a quick video just to let you know that without any fanfare and so-called under the radar, Microsoft has quietly redesigned the Windows 11 Insider program's website. So here we can see things looking a little bit different to how they were previously. Now the new website features Microsoft's latest design language. And as we can see, things are looking a lot more colorful with more colorful backgrounds, gradients, and icons. And we also get quick links to register in the program, join the program, preview windows, and so on. And yeah, you've got Windows Insiders get exclusive access to, and Microsoft lists what you get access to when you are signed up to the Insider program. And yeah, you've got insiders for business, for developers, and yeah, you've got to learn more about the channels and latest builds. So you get an overview of all the available channels that are available. And yeah, Microsoft gives us an explanation of what to expect from each channel and who they are made for. So Canary Channel would be ideal for highly technical users. Dev, ideal for enthusiasts. Beta, ideal for early adopters. Release preview, recommended for commercial users. And just on a quick side note, while we are talking about the different channels, if you don't know what a Windows Insider is or the Insider program is all about and what to expect for the different channels, I've posted a video, which I'll leave linked down below and in the end screen, where I gave you a quick overview and rundown of the program and the different channels. Check the video out if you'd like some more information. And if we scroll down yet to the bottom, Microsoft has this to say, Building Windows 11 was a major undertaking. We couldn't have done it without Windows Insiders. The energy and enthusiasm of Windows Insiders has helped create a new Windows 11 experience that brings you closer to what you love, empowering productivity and inspiring creativity. Now, I'm sure that's going to cause a bit of debate because if you've been viewing this channel for some time, you'll know that it almost feels like Microsoft is beta testing features with the general public and not in the insider program because there's so many features that have rolled out that have caused issues especially with the rollout of 24h2 that microsoft had to patch after it was rolled out to the general public that it does seem to some extent or the other that the public has been testing new features and not the insider program but nonetheless but nonetheless just wanted to keep you guys posted that the website has received a visual redesign, which I actually think is a step in the right direction. There's a lot more info and links and information available on this new redesign. So not just eye candy, I think that the functionality is a lot better as well. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.